Have you seen, I don't know which version of Men in Black it was, one or two or three, but um, one of them, they had a locker and in the locker was a bowl and in the bowl was another world. All hail, you know, they, it's sort of like that in the, in that we don't know what's missing with our reality. And that would explain, um, you know, crop circles and, you know, communication from other dimensions and uh, different religious beliefs turning up all over the world and glitches. But I think there's so much more. Trying to make one of them as, as truth just doesn't, um, I haven't like made the connection how one of them can be the truth because they kind of seem mutually exclusive but they're they're not to me they're like our beliefs change the lens of perception that we see um, is it our imagination being formed there's so many what ifs there's so many unanswered unprovable things about this world and how have we got the ability to think how do we have the ability to even think? But I've, yeah, I've been a bit of a belief explorer, you know, trying different things on, you know, and had completely different experiences of the world through these beliefs. Like when you believe this, the consequence of believing that is that your life is like this. And when you believe this, the consequence of believing that is that your life is like this. There's something about our identity, our avatar, playing this game, these beliefs are like different levels. There's so many different possibilities. Like when I'm at work, I am having a different experience. I'm having a diff there's a different level of the game that I'm playing, different things that I'm learning, different beliefs that I need to adjust and change and switch up and and see through. And when I see through this lens, this is my experience. When I see through this lens, this is my experience. And when I see when I have this belief, not only is this my experience, but it messes with their experience. It's like really interesting to me you know willing to mess with my identity which is like something that no one wants to do and also the struggle to get to that point where I was willing to mess with my identity and then realizing that my identity is this truth-seeking belief explorer uh, thing and maybe that's my identity that I don't want to get rid of and you know the whole confusing confusing way of trying to explain that but yeah and and my beliefs my lens my perceptions change so often and it's like wow because because it no longer serves me it's like what is life like if I actually do believe you that demons exist and if demons exist then how does that change my lens and if they don't exist then what is it if it's not demons is it my fears is it my inability to mess with my identity is it virtual reality messing with us making people around us live out their shadow is the shadow real where are their beliefs coming from why are they behaving responding having that experience when the rest of us aren't why are they living in such a dark world when the rest of us are living in a really easy kind of life and and they're looking at the same situation and it's so wrong to them so wrong it's so wrong and you're like but why is it so wrong for this one person has having the same experience as us but a totally different experience because they're having a completely dark shadow horrible experience and then what would describe that there's so much about this um, this world that we don't understand and I know what they're actually experiencing but how did I n get out of experiencing that I had to mess with my identity I had to mess with my beliefs and my lens and seek to look through a better lens to improve my experience but I'm still playing with my lenses I haven't decided on one yet it's not like um there's that um, costume over there I'm going to put that costume on and that's going to be me for the rest of my life no I've got this on today and in this moment and in this moment I am wearing this lens because this is the moment that I'm wearing this lens and then I'm speaking to somebody who's wearing this lens and then I'm I can put on a different lens to have this communication conversation with this this person on their level you know in and learn from that perspective that lens yep hope that completely uh, messed up your head too